Casey Scubia is a hairstylist and owner of Masa Moore Hair Salon here in downtown Sacramento. But had a close up shop on St. Patrick's Day due to the coronavirus outbreak. So a couple days before the forced um, shelter in place. So. To support herself and her family, Scubia is dropping off color kits to clients, but is refusing to do any house calls. If you would have asked me this three or four weeks ago, it's a quick, it's a hard no. But now it's like, I think we're all getting that feeling of like, I mean, we've been in, they've been in, it's tough, you know, um, but still, you know, truthfully, no, I can't. When it comes to getting help from the state, Scooby, like many salon owners, don't qualify for many of the COVID-19 small business loans. I'm getting daily, apply for this, do this, do this, the EIDL loan, the disaster relief loan. Look, that doesn't, that doesn't apply to me. I don't have employees. Technically, I'm a landlord, right? Because I have renters. Sacramento stylists and clients are teaming together in hopes of getting the attention of Mayor Daryl Steinberg to allow salons to service one client at a time, claiming that beauty salons are essential. Not every salon is small, right? You have salons that have 30 stylists, 15 stylists. How do you take one client at a time? When, what do you tell your, your stylist? Although Scubia doesn't believe that hairstylists are essential, she does think that salons could reopen if they followed safety guidelines similar to those followed at local groceries. We reached out to Mayor Steinberg's office regarding the petition, and he said, we are following the county's orders on what can and can't open. We aren't going to deviate from that and decide to allow one industry or another to open without public health guidance.